This summer at the unofficial guide of wizardry camp, we discovered some of the science behind the magic. Something that's really cool is showing the, all the chemistry behind it. You don't really think about chemistry when you watch Harry Potter. We did uh, transformations with pennies, so we changed pennies to gold and silver. Today we're doing an iodine clock reaction. So it's kind of like a potion, creating a potion. It turns from clear to black in like two seconds right in front of your eyes. And I think it gives students kind of a, a chance to do these things that they could do in a typical chemistry classroom, but then it being applied to something that they actually enjoy in like Harry Potter, which typically doesn't happen in a classroom setting. Um, I think it builds some kind of sympathy in students to see the animals and how they act. I know it's a different experience. Not every kid gets to touch a bearded dragon in their life. Giving students the opportunity to build themselves and their characteristics where they may not be able to have that chance in a school setting. I think I found a new love for science behind movies like that and I think it would be cool to tie it into my personal classroom as well. STEM can be a part of any classroom. It doesn't just have to be science and math. You can integrate all of those together in your English classrooms into my health classroom.